Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the Softcore Bunny, welcoming you back to Let's Play Holy Umbrella Dondera's Wild. Let's get to the what was it, Gila Giza Valley or whatever. Now we have more party members with Bonto. Although if we we don't have to do common here to change party members, we can just press L and R, which is very very convenient. So Bonto, well, is what he is. His big thing is, I guess, is that he's short. <laughs> he doesn't have to duck. In fact, he can't duck at all because he's essentially already ducking. So he can hit the few low to the ground enemies that are throughout the game. Uh, that's about it for his advantages, other than the fact that he's got this double jump, so he can go higher than everyone else, but his initial jump is lower than other characters as well. I don't really tend to use him much because his attack, which also is really, really, really short range compared to everyone else and also only hits in a straight line, it does about three-fourths the amount of damage as everybody else. So, not so great. Is everyone, even though it's not visible, all enemies have like a certain amount of hit points, more so than just the number of attacks you do to them, so. Ah, and then we have this hooking mechanic here. So yeah, I don't really use Bonto unless I have to, which is basically for double jumping and getting through small passages. So now we're introduced to the hook mechanic, which is what you do when you press the A button there. This is actually really fickle. As you can see, you can't be neck like right next to it. You kind of you have to really be on it. I've actually gotten pretty good at it myself. Oh, these guys. You can kill the bombs that they shoot too, but yeah, I've actually gotten pretty good with it myself. Now remember, enemies pretty much respawn the moment you get them off screen there, so be careful with that. Oh, just health. Yeah, I don't care about that. Yeah, so now we get something a little bit more difficult compared to the first stage, especially with the, all the that mechanic going on there. I was gonna try to prove that I could kill those bombs, but no! Okay, now I kinda need that heart. Go away, dude. Actually, I think I can get that with Bonto and... Forget it! Forget I said anything. Okay, fine. Can I? Not quite. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> Ay, ay, yeah. Anyway, I was gonna say, I think I can get that with Bonto and still make it back up onto the cliff with his double jump there, but, well, didn't have to. Anyway, treasure here. Got a strength orb, so we got more health. Nice. Nothing else up there. Let's see, that dude. Yeah, still can't run. That's another thing about Bonto. Unlike Ken, he's never gonna gain the ability to run either, so. That kind of sucks. Oh, I got a willpower orb, so we get more attack power. All characters share health and the strength and defense orbs there, so... We technically are a little stronger, though Bonto doesn't really get much out of it. Actually, let's take him anyway, just so I can... Oh! Missed it anyway. Ah! Anyway, I got this dude. It's a little tougher than the usual... Flunky, but here we get the gliding brooch, which is strictly for Ken. Well, he gets all the upgrades in the game. All characters otherwise are what they are when you get them. So yeah, that's why Bonto kind of sucks because he's the first character that joins you. So anyway, now we have the ability to glide, which is useful for stuff. Just keep in mind you can't activate it while you're jumping up. You have to be actually on your way down. So that's also kind of fickle at times when you're in a pinch there. See, there should be a sign that says something about the gliding brooch here. Yep. I don't know. Oh, yeah, see, they respawn so quick. I don't know if I can get back up there to get the... Oh, actually, I can. Sweet. Not that I really need that money, but it's there. Huzzah! Go away, dude. Yep, double jump only. There's plenty of spots where they force you to do this, so... 
yeah, I would have to hit that guy more than once if, if I, well, as you can see here. Oop. I can jump out of the crevice there, but... What would it be, crevasse? No, no way am I going to try to kill you with Bonto, especially since I can just do it with two hits with Ken, so... Don't need the health there. Hey! Nothing wait well, we've already seen what's way over there, basically. We get a lot of slow platforms like this in this area, so watch the guy with the bombs, those hurt. Come on. Oh, actually, I could make this a little faster with Bonto. So, he's got some use! Yay! And I do want to go up there. I gotta respawn fast. Holy cow! Ow! Oh yeah, that's all for health. Never mind. That's not really worthwhile. Uh, oh, I was gonna say, I'm surprised that guy didn't respond, but he did. Anyway. Ah! You again! Yeah, we're assuming you're the one who did it. Oh, yeah. You kind of made a mockery of me, but this time we should make a mockery of you! Okay, that's different, instead of a laugh. Yeah, I've got an umbrella and I know how to use it! You're not very bright when you think about it, but we'll do this anyway, because this is a really easy fight. Boss HP up there in the, well, as you can see, boss 130, 130 HP, I can, uh... Easily. Now he does that little cannon down there in the front. He can shoot out of that, but he doesn't do it very often. But yeah, as you can see, he's already basically dead. He can't even hit me as long as I'm right next to him. So yeah, he can fire a smaller gun out of that little cannon down there, but now nah, he very rarely does. At least in my experience. You know, for a tank, you have crap defense, dude. Oh, he was right behind him all along! Don't speak! Conserve your strength! I'm not dying, you punk! It's like, oh yeah, you actually seem to be pretty fine. Aw, Bonto's sad, or, well, happy. <laughs> How did we beat you here? Is it because we had the gliding brooch? Probably. These guys are Krillins! Look how short they are! Well, because you guys suck, apparently. How did it take you guys so long? Oh. So, you're like the Zoro of the game, huh? It's like, yeah, it's your fault! You have this crappy sense of direction! Sure did! And Bonto helped, sort of. And here I thought you were just a kid in a dumb hat and super short yellow shorts. Ah. Unfortunately, we are basically teleported out of there, or whatever, I mean, we... Back into, uh, the castle. Oh yeah, and there's portraits of the princess everywhere! It's like a Flintstones background or something. Uh, well, there are castles in Japan, but they're probably more like historical monuments at this point, so... I've never been there myself, so... I mean, well, I have been in Tokyo briefly, but that was just a layover. I didn't leave the airport, didn't have time, basically got off the plane and got back on, so... Oh. Well, I guess we did save the Royal Tutor. Oh, 
なあ my nose isn't bleeding but I get the feeling it would be in a few years <laughs> okay it's like I'm not in love not me When you think about it, that's kind of true. He just went out there with an umbrella thinking he could beat up a tank. It's like, yeah, I was wrong. Your hat's not so stupid. Clearly, everybody's talking about it. Oh, yeah. Emperor Dondera, huh? Oh. Oh. Typical. Oh, also kind of typical. Hmm. And yet, most of them are actually kind of okay, for the most part. <laughs> Everyone just complains they can't go outside, mostly. So, they attack their own? Uh. Well, alright. Yeah, by the way, I'm not planning to stick around at all, so... Yeah, can you send me back? Good luck with your problems! Eh? Ah! Oh. You... did? Why? How? How... Incredibly convenient for the plot and inconvenient for Ken. How are you connected to that? Oh, not gonna tell us, eh? Hmm. Oh, is he? Oh. Is he gonna give me another jewel? Because I haven't used the last one. And we're promptly kicked out of the castle. Yeah, that was me. Huh. Yeah, weren't you there? Jeez. Screw you too. What are you doing up here? Oh, uh, yeah, he was. Oh, yeah, you're kind of late on the draw there. For once, rumors don't travel faster. doing that, dude. A lot of people do have something new to say, but not everyone does. Yes. Yes, you did. You're outside now. Oh, yeah, you were in the end before. Yeah, not everyone has something new to say. Yeah, I don't need to talk to absolutely everyone. Oh, uh, yeah, you don't have anything interesting to say either. Fine. Let's just talk to the folks in the inn, since that's where we're going anyway. Oh, cool. Awesome. Might as well save. I wasn't actually expecting to do a no damage run on that guy, but he didn't do anything particularly mean. I mean, not that he really can, but... Ah, yes! I've already explained this last time, but... Ah, yeah, only the important items again. Doesn't tell you about the stuff hidden in, well, this and whatnot. Ah, there's Ki uh, Kilorn. Weren't you there? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what came over me. Just, I got this umbrella. Oh, yeah, Bonto was there too.
Well, we're still taking that at face value, so... Yeah, I was just... Yeah, kind of on my way home, like always, and... Rain, and then an umbrella, and... Yeah... Kidding? Umbrellas are amazing in this world! It must be the same umbrella. And we get the Umbra port. Okay. Oh. Oh. Why is, is he in there and why are you assuming that? Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, what do I have to do with this holy umbrella? Oh. Oh. Uh, okay. It's like, yeah, I'm just a kid, but sure, why not? Oh. Like me. <laughs> well, I mean, he is useful. It's just only on the action stages, not so much against bosses. Oh, I didn't mean to say that. That reminds me, I do want to buy uh, another item. I mean, I still only have the one bottle. We'll get more later, but yeah, I would like to finally pick up the. Well, not that I needed it already, but I might as well pick up the life orb. It's very, very useful. Yep, 300 Seville. I got more than enough money. Nah. Anyway, let's go ahead and... Oh, yeah, let's press X to use that. Hmm. The Legends. The Life. The Legends. The long, long ago in a galaxy far, far away. Gods and... Goblins? Not devils? Or demons? Or... Oh, goblins are powerful in this world. No. It just randomly it happened one day? I think that is about as direct as they are about this energy that appears, so... Huh. Okay. Oh. It's waging holy war, huh? And... Oh, he lost? Really? Well, that's kind of shocking. Oh. But he lost. Is it really that great of an umbrella? Oh. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Could have done that all along. Huh. Interesting. It's like, and in retaliation, we just killed him. Oh. Seven, eh? It's like the Dragon Balls, except, well, umbrellas. at the other part of the research report there. <laughs> yeah, we're just... It's just a legend. It's not real or anything. Oh. Ah. Yeah, not to mention they all have umbrellas stored in their churches. Ugh. <sighs> Uh... Oh, yeah? Oh, but it was kind of meant for human use. The god gave the humans the umbrella. Oh. 
Don't do it, man! Don't do it! And then we have page three, which is for some reason blank. Huh. Odd. Anyway. A? The castle? Oh, yeah, that's what he said. Something's up. Crud! <laughs> Maybe we need to save the princess. Like Mario. Next time on Let's Play Holy Umbrella. Arrivederci.